This is the fifth grade Kansas Social Studies Weekly, week 21, the shot heard around the world test. Please remember to put your name at the top for multiple choice number one. When was the Second Continental Congress held? A. Fall of 1777 B. Summer of 1775 C. Winter of 1778 or D. Spring of 1774 This is on the inside of your newspaper. Number two, which was not a reason that George Washington was asked to lead the Revolutionary Army. His good judgment, his experiences in the French and Indian War, his honest character, or he was an excellent hunter. Again, which one is not a reason that they chose him to be the leader of the army? Number three. Patriot Thomas Paine was widely known for writing which paper? A. Common Sense B. A Christmas Carol C. The Harry Potter Series or D. The Declaration of Independence This is on the inside of your newsletter on the right-hand side. Number four. What was the Olive Branch Petition? A. A last appeal to King George III. B. They decided to send olive branches to Parliament. C. They were telling King George III that they decided to go to war. Or D. The beginnings of negotiations between the colonies and Parliament. This is on the inside of your news article under the section Continental Congress. And number five, during what battle did the colonial soldiers show that they were not intimidated by the British soldiers? A. Breed's Hill and Bunker Hill B. Brown Hill C. Border Hill or D. Broker Hill that is also in the highlighted section of the Continental Congress in the middle. Number six. Why were the British regulars ordered to Lexington and Concord? That is on the front page. Number seven. What does the phrase a shot heard round the world mean? Number eight. Explain why Thomas Jefferson was chosen to write the Declaration of Independence. That is on the bottom right hand side on the inside of your newspaper article. There's a whole section about why he was chosen. Number nine, after which action by the Parliament did Congress finally decide to fully support independence? That is also in the Continental Congress section. And then number ten, how did Thomas Paine use his pamphlet, Common Sense, to convince the colonists to declare for independence from Great Britain? That is on the inside, on the far right-hand side, there's a whole section about common sense and Thomas Paine. You may pause and go back and listen to each question over again as you need to. Whenever you are done, please turn in your test and the newspaper article is yours. You do not need to turn that in.